Hi, I'm your host, Cookie, and please know I would fall on my sword for you guys. Just not on the sharp side. Two players. Someone will win, someone will lose. The stakes couldn't be higher. Let's do this. This is round one, and that means you get 500 points for fooling your opponent with your made-up answer. And you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's your first question. Psycho was the first American movie to show a blank. Now use your device to type a lie that might fool your opponent into believing it. If you get stuck for half the points, you can use the help button and get a suggestion. Do it now. Okay, there are your choices. Find the truth and enter it on your device by touching the answer you want. Okay, what did everyone pick? And nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. The mountain logo on a package of Toblerone chocolate contains a hidden image of a blank. Type in your lies now. Hurry up, use a suggestion if you... Okay, here you go, find the truth. All right, who picked what? And nobody picked the other lies up there. Select a category. Okay, here's the question. Coca-Cola once commissioned a video game from Atari called Pepsi Blank. Enter your lies now. Where's the truth? <laughs> All right, let's see what everybody picked. And that means... This is round two, which means all point values are doubled. Exciting! All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. During the 1990s, teachers in North Korea were, oddly enough, required to know how to blank. Type in your lies now.
Okay, here are your choices. Okay, let's take a look. Even in the classroom, North Koreans are pro-torture. And the rest of the board goes unselected. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. Moviegoers who use their cell phones at the Prince Charles Cinema in London are escorted out by people dressed as blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? Let's see what everybody selected. Well, don't you feel foolish. <laughs> and look at what we have left. One single, lonely, pitiful lie. <laughs> Select a category. Okay, here's the question. Blair Tolman wrote a self-help book called Blank for Under a Dollar, 301 Ideas. Type in your lies now. Okay, here are your choices. Alright, let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> Disclaimer, all of them will be first dates. And that's it. Nobody else's lives got picked. Welcome to the final fibbage. This is your final question, and it's worth triple. It's anybody's game. Here's your final fibbage question. The Michelin Man's strange official name. Enter your lies now. All right, where's the truth? Okay, let's take a look. But now it's hard to see him as anything but a bibendum. And that means some of these didn't get picked.
Hi, I'm your host, Cookie, and if my voice is turning you on, then I'm sorry for not being sorry. Oh, two players it is. It won't be weird if I call you mom and dad, will it? Good, let's do this. This is round one. You'll get 500 points for fooling your opponent with your lie. And you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's your first question. Pam Anderson wrote a book of recipes with the title, How to Cook Without a Blank. Type in your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? Well, you guys blew it. Step one, throw this book out. And we're done. Select a category. Okay, here's the question. Ward Shelley and Alex Schwader's art piece, In Orbit, which was on display at a gallery in New York, featured two men living in a giant blank for 10 days. Enter your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? All right, who picked what? You have to understand art to get it. You see, the wheel is symbolic of their desperate need for attention. And nobody picked the other lies up there. Time to pick a category. That's okay, I've got it. Okay, here's the question. In 2013, Dell issued a recall after customers complained their laptop smelled like blank. Type in your lies now. Where's the truth? <laughs> All right, let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> and look what we have here. <laughs> And that means... Now 
what's round two, where all point values are doubled. Let's do it. Select a category. Okay, here's the question. All Grim Acres is a nine-hole miniature golf course oddly located in an Illinois blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, here are your choices. Let's see what everybody selected. It's hard to get your ball out of the cup though, those holes are six feet deep. And the rest of the board goes unselected. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. The New York Times was forced to issue a correction after they incorrectly identified the Nintendo characters Mario and Luigi as blank instead of plumbers. Type in your lies now. Where's the truth? Okay, what did everyone pick? And that means some of these didn't get picked. Time to pick a category. Well, we ain't waiting forever. Okay, here's the question. The 1995 Diagram Prize for Oddest Book Title of the Year went to the book Reusing Old Blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? Okay, let's take a look. Well, you guys blew it. And nobody fell for this one. This is the final fibbage. One question left for all the marbles, and everything is worth triple. Good luck. Okay, here is your final fibbage question. Item that teachers at Mounts Bay Academy in England were banned from using in 2014. Type in your lies now.
Hurry up. Use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Let's see what everybody selected. There was a sentence fragment in the memo and there was nothing they could do about it. And nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. Hi there, my name's Cookie Masterson. Ah, it feels so good to finally admit that. Ah, a three-person game. Or as the French call it, a menage a threesome. Let's do this. This is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool. And you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. Select a category. Okay, here's your first question. A science student in Nepal has created an innovative solar panel that is far cheaper to make than a traditional solar panel because it's made with blank. Enter your lies now. If you can't think of something. All right, where's the truth? Let's see what everybody picked. Well, don't you feel foolish. Time to pick a category.
It's not hard. You know what? We'll just stick with this one. Okay, here's the question. Highway construction in Iceland was delayed in 2013 after advocates claim the project would destroy the natural land where blank live and thrive. Type in your lies now. Hurry up, use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. Okay, which one's the truth? All right, who picked what? It worked! Said a hobo wearing Spock ears and a Santa hat. And that's it. Nobody else's lives got picked. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. After an allergic reaction to steroids used to treat asthma, a 28-year-old woman started growing blank on her head instead of hair. Enter your lies now. Hurry, hit the lie for me button if you can't think of something. Okay, here are your choices. Okay, what did everyone pick? <laughs> and look what we have here. <laughs> now when she wants to look nice, she goes out and gets a Manny Hetty. And that means this lie didn't get picked. This is round two, which means all point values are doubled. Exciting. Select a category. Okay, here's the question. Patton actor George C. Scott refused to accept the Oscar he won in 1971, claiming the Academy Awards is a two hour blank parade. Type in your lies now. All right, where's the truth? Let's see what everybody selected. Well, you guys blew it. 
but that was in the 70s. Now it's a four-hour meat parade. And we're done. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. In 2013, researchers at the University of Tokyo developed the incendiary reflection, a mirror that makes it look like you're blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. All right, who picked a watch? And nobody picked the other lies up there. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. Cambridge University economist Ha Jun Chang holds an unpopular opinion. He insists that the blank changed the world more than the internet. Type in your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? Okay, let's take a look. And the rest of the board goes unselected. It's time for the final fibbage. Just one final question and it's worth triple. Good luck. Here's your final fibbage question. Wilma Flintstone's maiden name. Enter your lies now. All right, where's the truth? All right, let's see what everybody picked. Yeah, she was only 30,000 years away from being progressive enough to hyphenate her name to Wilma Slaghoople Flintstone. And nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies.
Hello everyone, this is Drawful. Wow, three player game. I like it. Everybody will get three shots at drawing something not terrible. Let's get things started. Okay, I'm sending a title to each of your devices. Something unusual, like Direwolf or Pop and Lock. Draw a picture on your device that would have that title, and when you're done, hit send, and you'll get points for each player that can correctly guess your title. So, good luck. Great, all the pictures are in. Um. Now, use your device to type in what you think the title for this picture could have been. Or better yet, something you think could trick the other players into thinking it's the title. You'll get points for every player that picks your answer. All right, here are your choices. Now pick the title you think really inspired this drawing. Ah! Hey! All right, who picked what? Hey! All right, well, we're done with that now. Oh. Let's do this one. Enter your titles now. And here are your choices. Here's everybody's picks. You're all wrong. Everybody's wrong. Um. Type in a convincing title now. Okay, here are your choices. Hey! And here are your picks. Hey! Good stuff. Good, good stuff. 
Another batch of titles are heading to your devices as I speak. Get ready to draw them. Now that I've got all your drawings, it's time for some fun. Um. Type in your titles now. Fifty-five. Ah! Fifty. Twenty-five. Hey. Here are your choices. What did everybody pick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You all got it right. Don't get big heads about it. Um. And this one. Okay, here are your choices. And here are your picks. Um. Let's take a look at our next piece of art. And here are your choices. Here's everybody's picks. Hey! You mean the irreverent party trivia game where pop culture and high culture collide? Never heard of it. Okay, one last batch of drawing titles headed to your devices now.
Hey! Okay, let's get to the good part. Um. And now, this thing. Ah! <laughs> okay, here are your choices. I might try to forget any of this ever happened. Okay, our next drawing. Your choices. Hey! Ah! Here's everybody's picks. I don't like it when everybody gets it right, but I'm a petty person. Put in your titles now. choices. Hey! What did everybody pick? Hey! Okay, so that happened.
Another game of Drawful? Don't mind if I do. Let's skip all the instructions and get right to those titles that I've already sent to your devices. Okay, weirdos, let's take a look at your artwork. Oh. Enter anything that could almost make sense now. And here are your choices. Ah! Hey! And here are your picks. And why the long face? Okay, let's do this again. Okay, here are your choices. And sometimes, everybody gets it right. Um. Type in a convincing title now. Here are your choices. Hey! Here's everybody's picks. <laughs> Boom! Everybody got it right. <laughs> Okay, get ready to draw again. The new titles should be on your devices now.
Hey! I have your drawings, and I know what to do with them. Um. Now let's take a look at this one. And here are your choices. Hey! What did everybody pick? <laughs> and no one got it wrong. Um. And now this. Okay, here are your choices. Pick something. Here's everybody's picks. I like this group of players. I don't know why. I just do. Um. Type in your titles now. Hey! And here are your choices. All right, who picked what? Huh, I didn't expect everybody to get that one right. You all get to draw one more time. Look to your devices for your new titles. I have all your pictures now. Um, these are interesting. Uh, let's take a look. Um. Next up. Here are your choices.
And here are your picks. Sure, beefs with an S. That kind of makes sense, right? Um. Enter your titles now. Okay, here are your choices. Ah! Hey! Here's everybody's picks. Hey! Are we done with this one? I think we're done with this one. Um. Put in your titles now. And here are your choices. Hey! What did everybody pick? Hey! Does anyone pay attention to the things I say here before going to the score tallies? I don't think they do. I really don't. Mm -hmm. 